that time of the year again when music lovers flock to a farm in northern Limpopo for a weekend of camping to catch their favourite artists at the Opikopi Music Festival. The festival falls on Women's Day and female South African artists took to the stage to wow the crowds. <laughs> Future ghetto funk and internationally recognized artist Moonchild says that women need to step up their game in the male-dominated music industry. Because you're a woman, you need to be extra talented. You can't just be pretty. Like you've got added pressure if you happen to be pretty. No matter the talent you have, because you, you're, you're putting yourself in a position where people, whether when you succeed, they're always going to say it's your looks. All female South African band Japan and I have recently performed on the international stage at the Primavera Festival in Barcelona. But it's also been quite the journey as female artists. Especially when we first started, a lot of people would say, wow, well, you're good for a girl band. You know? uh, yeah. Yeah. And I suppose that was like, oh, okay, what does that mean? You know yeah. what I mean? Like, why can't we just be, just be good, good band. musicians, you know? Mm. So, but I think because we've been around for a while, you know, we're not such spring chickens. <laughs> I think people have got kind of used to seeing us. So yeah. We don't really get comments like that anymore. You need to be able to know that you've got power. And, like, it's, 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 it's I don't know why it has to be put in a negative way. And so, um, musically, a lot of women hate on each other. They don't work together. It's very rare to find women working together. Even if, like, people will pay, will come and watch your show and pay to watch you and just criticize you. But not looking at the fact that they just took their time to come and see you, which obviously you're doing something right. Where I'm standing, there's uh, a lot of togetherness. I mean, in the artists that I've met, for instance, Moonchild, and DJ Satori, Davina Satori, they, you know, they'll do their gigs together and they'll put each other on and they, they'll handle their own stuff. I don't think change is something that can happen overnight, you know, it's, it's going to be a long-term, slow process, but the, the more people start thinking differently, behaving differently, obviously then that movement's yeah. going to change and perceptions will change, so I think we need more girl bands to help that happen. People that I like that, you know, just seem to find you know, balance in, in their artistry and egos and personal stuff to just make beautiful music. I respect that more than anything, you know. And I believe that people should do it out of love as well. As, as much as we're women, you know, it's, it's not a blind, oh, you're a woman, whatever, whatever. And then, you know, we're like stuck in a mediocre kind of state, you know. Support what's good. Therefore, encourage people to be at their best. And if it's not, they must hear the hard truth so that they can learn. You know, and that's the only way we, I think, we can fight for our equality. Who knows how many female musicians will start pushing the limits as the female artists from By Benico, an experimental group, comment. Use your, your womanly powers use them and um, yeah just don't don't let the the fact that it's a male dominated industry um, put you off because it's so amazing seeing front female people and yeah I think just just give it your best and, and don't give up and do it. The rocking woman of Opikopi remind us that women should be celebrated every day and not only in August. For more coverage on the festival, visit www.sabc.co.za forward slash news and Twitter at SABC News Online. For SABC News in Northern, I'm Nina Westhuizen.